Hello and thank you for purchasing a new John Deere tractor from Deer Country Farm and Lawn. I want to go over the basic operation of a X300 series tractor on this video. On the right side you have your brake pedal and you also have your forward and reverse pedal. As far as the brake pedal you have to push that all the way in to initially start it and you could also use it if you push it all the way in you hold this uh, orange lever up, you would lock the park brake into place. Your forward and reverse pedal, the harder you push, faster you go. The yellow button, if you flip this up, that would start the blades turning. To allow you to mow in reverse, you would have to hold this, uh, push in the yellow button before you hit the reverse pedal. So if the blades are turning, before you hit the reverse pedal, you'd have to push in the yellow button. The other thing on the right is the cruise control button, which this is. If you find the speed you like, hold the, the forward pedal in place, push the button down, that would lock the pedal at a set speed. Here's where your key goes in, all the way to the right would crank the engine. Back to the left one position is the running position. Back to the left one more position would turn the headlights on and then the off position. The left pedal is to raise and lower the mower deck and that works along with the lock position which this lever activates here to, to keep the mower deck in the highest position if you wish and your dial in the middle actually sets your cut height so if you want to readjust your cut height to a uh, right now it's set at one and three quarter if you wanted to raise that you push the left pedal all the way in and you turn the lever to where you wanted to set your cut height at. And again, this lever here would just lock the mower deck in the highest position, maybe for storage or, or loading it on a trailer. That would leave it in the highest position. Here's your throttle and choke. Throttle controls your engine speed. The inside lever for choke, that's used uh, for cold starting. You just hold that all the way up and once the attractor initially starts you'd, you'd release that and that will release on its own the digital display in the dash that's going to have uh that's going to show you your your fuel gauge it's going to have an hour meter there showing how many hours are on the tractor if the parking brakes engaged there will be an indicator showing that if the blades are running there's an indicator uh, that that's uh, what's displayed in the dash here's where your gasoline goes in on the mower deck you have your wash port you hook a hose to that you run the water hop back on the tractor run the blades that would circulate water through the underside of the mower deck your shields flip up easily for cleaning some basic service on, on this particular tractor. There's where you check your oil, your oil filter, air filter, battery, spark plug on each side, inline fuel filter. So that's your basic operation of the X300 series tractor. Again, thank you for purchasing. Thank you.